Oh, hello. You caught me doing a bit of grocery shopping. Even doctors need to eat. <laughs> the question is, what in the world do these nutrition labels mean? Let's take a closer look. While we're here, why don't we chat about nutrition labels? These are the black and white chart boxes on packages of food that give information about what is in the food. You can find them by looking for the box that says Nutrition Facts. Nutrition facts say things like calories, fat, vitamins, and ingredients. But what do they all mean? Nutrition labels show the nutrients in food, which are things your body needs to stay healthy. You will see the amount of these nutrients written in G for grams or Mg for milligrams. People who are experts in nutrition have figured out about how much of each key nutrient people should eat every day. This is called the daily value of each nutrient. So, when you look at a label and see percent daily value, this shows how much of that daily need of each nutrient you can get by eating this food. It's important to know that this number is based on grown-ups, so it's not the same for everyone, but it's a good helper. Let's take a look at what each part of the nutrition label means. Let's start with the ingredients list. When you make food at home, like a cake, you follow a recipe, which has a list of ingredients like flour, eggs and oil that are needed to make the finished yummy product. The ingredients list on the nutrition label shows what ingredients went into making that packaged food. Grown-ups will read this list to make sure the food is made from healthy ingredients, and more importantly, to see if there's anything that we are allergic to in the package. To better understand allergies, be sure to take a look at my peanut allergy video on drsmiley.com. At the top of the label, you'll see serving size. It may say something like one cup of cereal, three crackers, or five ounces of juice. This tells grown-ups how many nutrients shown on the nutrition facts are in the exact serving size. Eating more than the serving size will mean you are eating more than the nutrients shown. So, what are the basic nutrients on every nutrition label? Let's start with the biggest one, calories. Calories give your body energy. It is important to know how many are in your food, because eating too many can make you gain weight. And if you're on a diet, eating less calories will make you lose weight. The next one is fat. Your body uses fat to grow and develop, but eating too much fat is unhealthy. You might see different kinds of fat listed on nutrition facts, such as saturated, unsaturated, and trans fat. These different kinds of fats will have different effects on your body. The next one is cholesterol. This nutrient is listed because many people need to be careful how much cholesterol they eat, especially if they need to pay extra attention to their heart health. Next up, we have sodium, which is a fancy word for salt. Like cholesterol, this nutrient is listed because many people want to limit how much sodium they eat every day, especially if they have certain health problems, such as hypertension. You can learn about how sodium affects these patients on my hypertension video. Carbohydrates, or carbs, are also used by the body to create energy. They are usually broken down into dietary fiber, which is a good carb, and sugar, which we all want to limit to keep our bodies healthy. Diabetics must pay super close attention to the carbohydrate content on the labels. Be sure to take a look at my diabetes video when you have time. Protein is a nutrient your body uses to build strong muscles and to keep your organs and blood healthy. The bottom section of the nutrition facts will show special nutrients like vitamin A, vitamin C, calcium, and iron. These vitamins and minerals are important for keeping your eyes, immune system, skin, hair, heart, bones, teeth, brain, and muscles healthy. While these are the most common, there are many different nutrients that can be shown on a nutrition label. Remember, people with food allergies or special health needs need to pay extra attention to nutrition labels. I encourage you to read these nutrition facts and learn all about the ingredients in your favorite foods so you can understand the best ways to keep your body healthy and growing strong. Do you have a question for Dr. Smarty? Leave us a comment, send us a message, or tweet it to Ask Dr. Smarty. And be sure to like, follow, and subscribe to keep up on all things Dr. Smarty.